Welcome back to Insomniac Live. It is a. Did you just jump? I did. You jumped a little bit. Yeah, you I'm jumped? used to like my like much more, more boring, boring style. style. Yeah, yeah, no, yeah. Whereas you have so much energy. Yeah, much and you know, wakes it's me up. like you're on stage. The world <laughs> is but a stage. Uh, it's a, a beautiful Wednesday here in Burbank, California. Yeah, yeah. Instead of being outside and playing like Corey did at lunch. We're inside and playing video games. Playing video games. And making video games. Which, which is way cool. I mean, you have to be, you have to point it out that they're outside, outside playing Frisbee. Like, come on. Yeah. Come the, on. You know, people are spending lunch playing Frisbee. They're not, like, chained to their desks. You know, we're busy. We're yeah. very busy. Yeah. Actually, I was, I was more just trying to, like, put Corey down. Like, they're not doing something cool. They're playing Frisbee. Yes, even in the chat, Corey's like, Frisbee rules. Hello to everyone watching. Anastasia, Jack Knighton. Lombax the Great, Emperor Sheev Palpatine. Oh, that's scary. We're in trouble. <laughs> uh, how y'all doing? Uh, we're, today we're playing a game called Far Cry 5. Can't wait. It came out yesterday from Ubisoft. And, yeah, this uh, game looks incredible. Yeah, I'm, I'm very excited to play it because I've always enjoyed the Far Cry games yep. and the sort of like open world shooter -y drive around blow shit up oh yeah uh, and this one like the, the they do they do their villains so well recently like ever since like three i feel like yeah like all their villains are just awesome yeah. this one looks like it's gonna be no exception yeah um yeah i'm excited so we've literally like created a character saw some crazy stuff in a church and now we're flying in and landing and oh, there's a flamethrower already so the game's already good fergie dark zamas uh, McTo uh, McToby, hi, McToby says, when's the next Ratchet stream? Friday! Yeah. Play Ratchet and Clank on PS4 this Friday. Um, so we'll get one more in during its free month on PlayStation Plus. If you haven't gotten it yet, which I think most of you guys have, you should go download that for free while you still can, because next week they take it out of the free games, and they give you Mad Max or something. Cool. Which, you know, it's a good game. Yeah, I haven't played it, but, you know. Hey, it's free. Yeah. If you have PS Plus. Yeah. But... This week, the hotness is Far Cry, and yes. everyone's been talking yes, yes, about it, and everyone's been playing it. I played this at E3. Yeah, I was so really did I. I was so really bad I. at it at E3. Oh. I died a lot. <laughs> I played through it like three times. Like, church. Yeah, I couldn't get enough of it. Did you get fast passes to play through, or did you wait in line Oh, of times? course I got fast okay, passes. Right, yeah. <laughs> the Ubisoft booth is like Disneyland. There's fast passes, and, <laughs> and I just go to Stone Chin, who's my friend in PR at Ubisoft, and I'm like, give me your fast passes, man. Yeah. Did they take yours away after each one? Uh, sometimes they did, sometimes they didn't. Okay, I was lucky. They didn't take mine away until the last game I wanted to play. Nice. Um, so I got to play literally But I had like a stack thing. like this, and then did I handed you? them out to a bunch of friends. Oh, nice, I was like, nice. oh yeah, you need to go play, you want to go play that Ubisoft game? Like, here you go. You want to go play Mario and Rabbids? Here, and use this. <laughs> Which even then still took like, it was still like a 25 minute wait or 30 minutes. Oh my god, the Mario, the, fast pass. the Mario one was like 45 minutes for me. Yeah, it was, it was crazy. really it long. It was crazy. Uh, Kronzy is hosting us. Thanks awesome. for that. Thank you, RM81, thanks for the follow. Yeah, um, I actually have only seen this game so far from Kron's uh, playthrough. Oh, nice. Uh, yeah, the game looks I haven't really awesome. been following it. I've been so busy the last few weeks. As sure, you know, sure. People may have noticed that I haven't been on the stream as much, uh, that I have not uh, seen much of it recently. So I'm excited to finally play some. Oh, guys, guess what I got today? Guess what I picked up about Spy today? Uh oh, what'd you get? I got my last uh, 4K Dolby Vision. Nice, congratulations. So congratulations. Guess what I'm watching tonight. Last Jedi yeah. in 4K. The best, on your the best Star Wars movie since Empire Strikes Back. There you go. I can hear Corey just fuming back there. I love it. I like the movie. Oh, okay. I like the movie. Alright, yeah. good. I don't know who does and doesn't anymore. Everyone's <laughs> trying to troll the shit out of me on it, so. I'm not Corey. I have good taste. Uh, did you see the honest trailers for it yesterday? Yeah. It's funny because it's like it has like the old narrator complaining about it, while the new narrator is happy about the movie, and basically like the whole honest trailer is them nice. debating the film. That's really great. Nice. Uh, okay. Best character in Star Wars: Rose or Jar Jar? Oh, that I I, uh, I, I should I should have read it in my head first. I yeah. messed up. Yeah. Damn it, Corey. Uh, noob and Co says, how are we doing? How are you doing? How are you today? I'm doing well. I'm doing well. Yeah, I can't, can't complain. How about you? Right. You've, been, you've been busy recently, but... Busy? Busy? Yeah. Uh, yeah. Uh, I, I did get to have Parks Barbecue on Monday night. Nice. And then I saw you had... Um, I had Howlin' Rays yesterday, and I have Howlin' Rays in the fridge for tonight. Damn. So that's good. Uh, and... Yeah. It's been, uh, 
it's been good overall. I'm kind of creeped out. I don't know exactly what's going on, but it, I mean, obviously we're U.S. Marshals and we're confronting yep. some like cult or maybe not cult, but kind of. Yeah, yeah, no, it's a cult. All right. Are we gonna play properly or end it in ten minutes? I think I think he's referencing his playthrough that like oh, stopped like ten minutes, like oh. ten minutes in, because uh, like some di some dust got on the uh, eject button and popped out his disc. Oh well, hopefully that won't happen. You never know. <laughs> Uh, Remaster Resistance Last Jedi is good, so there. It is. It's a good, it's a darn good movie. Uh, it's beautiful too. Oh my god! Yeah, like seeing it in theaters is I can't like. Wait to watch it again. My jaw was on the dr on the ground like the whole time. But look at this. We'll talk about this for a second. Look at how good it looks. Yeah, it looks incredible. I mean, I like his tattoos too. His I like skin. His the skin just looks awesome there. Yep. Like his and the lighting on it. Yeah, it's really a great cool. shot with like his his crew in the background like I don't know who any of those people are because I didn't read the but book see, you can see how far I can twist the like yep. well, before the camera I can only twist it just to those two guys so it was like perfectly framed no matter what you still have this little bit of control definitely right, those, his eyes are kind of freaking me out though right now yeah it's like he's boring right into my soul <laughs> oh I get to arrest the father let's do this get him sometimes the best thing to do uh oh that didn't go well if you want to quick finish uh, to quick finish the game, just don't arrest him. That's funny. Didn't they have something like that in like three or something? Where you could just where you could just like you don't do what they tell you and you wait like ten minutes and then like the game ends. <laughs> That's funny. Let's go. Let's walk him out of here. Oh look, check it out. He's even got like a weird tattoo thing on his back or like carved out of his back. Thank you for waiting for me guys to open the door. Jacob, John, and Fate. Those are the three. His, uh, his crew. Okay. And yeah, Far Cry 4 is the one I'm thinking of. Jared Leto Sim, 18. Yeah. yeah, Corey, that's right. I like how the tint in his glasses, too. Yeah, that's a good one. It's just like this little polishy thing where it's like everything's blue, but yeah, this like green tint of the guy's yeah. glasses that you can see through. Is that Amazing Grace playing? Probably. I have no idea how much noise there is in the house. Can't hear a thing. It's a shame. Oh shit. Ubisoft Montreal. Those Canadians. I'm always like happy that Ubisoft is able to put out such like high quality games. I think it's cool to see a, a studio. I'm amazed like their production is cool. like incredible to be able to like coordinate everything across countries. Oh, like, dude, we're shooting people. That's absurd. Oh so. god, this craziness is coming. Uh, yeah, they have a lot of people. Uh, <laughs> oh, oh. <laughs> that's so oh. gross. <laughs> Wow. Wow, that's that's dedication to a cause to throw yourself into the front of the helicopter blade. Crazy. Wow. I'm just surprised the helicopter actually crashed because of that. But it's probably it makes sense. I guess it would if it chunked something that big. Probably, right? Oh no. I'm willing to give him the benefit of the doubt that that would happen. If George Lucas didn't make The Phantom Menace in 2017, would what? I'm, I'm confused. He did make. I don't understand what the question is there because he didn't make The Phantom Menace in 2017. Is that a bug? What? It's what? What? Oh, the headphones are hanging like that. Yeah, oh, he's no, upside no, down. They're hanging. Yeah, you're upside down. Come on, Corey. Get it together. What if George Lucas did make it in oh. 2017? Uh, I don't know. I don't know. Like, is the is the is it trying to question like would it be better with modern visuals or? I don't understand I don't the question. I don't understand. Like, you, are you saying like he never made another movie? Like he didn't make the prequels back then and then waited, or? I don't know. 
Phantom Menace is underrated. Is it? Yes. Oh, how do you say that? Like, it's actually got a lot of great set pieces, a lot of great practical sets. Um, Obi Wan's great in that movie. Um, the basically like all the stuff on Tatooine is really interesting and good. Like the pod race is fun. Um, when they go back, like the Gungan battle kind of sucks, but like the Starfighter battle is actually pretty good. Like it's just because it's like kiddie, I think, is the problem. So the kid These actors are like. The kid, the kids are the like the problem in that movie more than anything, and like and Jar Jar, but you know, like there's a lot of like really good stuff. It's just maybe not executed. Um, by the way, you just got betrayed by your dispatch on the, the headset. Awesome. Like you, you're like, hey, they're like, hey, are you there? Are you there? And then the father answers and he's like, everything's fine. And then she's she confirms that they're working together. Stupid dispatcher. Never trust this one. Never. never trust the person behind the computer. That's why I'll never trust Cory. Right. We can't trust our own dispatch. I mean, uh, look at the comments he's making in the chat. Can't trust that guy. Remaster Resistance says Blast Jedi is worse than Phantom Menace, which is just incorrect. I agree. Incorrect. Period. I agree that, that, it, that it, it is incorrect. Get out of the seatbelt! Get out of the seatbelt! Go! Oh, unfortunately the X button allowed me to get out of the seatbelt. Now I gotta run into the woods, huh? Yep. Run away! Run away! Fortunately I'm really good at running in uh, shooters, because uh, like I used to play a lot of Capture the Flag Halo, hmm. and that's just about trying to run as fast as possible and so dodge people. You've been preparing for this? I've been preparing my entire life for this. I think you're gonna make it then. Jeremy or Justin today? Neither. With Corey. Yeah, Corey's Corey is actually here today. Wait a second, what's that? Yeah. Oh wait, now. Oh, just a log. Lame. <laughs> That's all you need. Okay, so we have a detection meter. Yep. Yeah. So now we gotta like get some ammo and guns, both of those things really. Get him! Get him! Sneaky, sneaky! Whack! Give me your gun! Give me your gun! Nice. <laughs> Hit him one more time just for good measure. Mm. Corey actually decided to do some work today. Amazing. It's so funny, you guys think like, oh, Cory wasn't doing work because he wasn't here, but if he's not here, that means he's definitely doing work. <laughs> Alright. I, I probably shouldn't be scouting, but you never know. Yeah, oh, no, no, you're fine, you're fine. Loot, loot, loot. Yeah, oh, see, it's seven also, bullets. Um, okay. Seven bullets. So it's the same button for a reload as, uh, as interact? Maybe, yeah, okay. yeah. You gotta hold that square button down. Sorry, I guess. Okay, in that case, that. All right. Well, hey, we now. Oh, more handgun ammo. Nice. Well, now we have thirteen bullets. All right, we're set. We're set. Yeah, we can take on this entire army now. Have you got any legs in the game? Uh, yes. I think I. Yep. Yep. Yeah, you there's do. a leg. Not like resistance, where it was just arms in the air. Mm -hmm. Which is really handy at times, actually, because like the only way to do it, place a dynamic light when you're taking screenshots, was to. Uh, It's always funny making uh, shooters or FPSs because you remember, like, but the camera is like essentially in the chest, right? right. Um, so it's interesting. Okay, so I gotta meet Marshall somewhere. But yeah, the uh, we we always have the arms floating around, but you could turn the flashlight on and then move the arms around with the debug menu, mm -hmm. and then when you did that, it let you. Uh, what was really great about that was then we were able to uh, uh, put a light on stuff, even though oh, we cool. didn't really have any like cinematic tools to put a light on anything. Awesome. Um, cool story, Adam. Thank you. <laughs> what a jerk. <laughs> okay, now I have. Oh shit. <sighs> 
<laughs> it's an interesting game dev anecdote. I thought it was appropriate. Okay, so <laughs> I was like, oh, there's just two guys by the fire. There was a lot more than two guys by the fire. The shotgun ammo? Where's the shotgun, though, is the real question. But still, I killed them all. Um, press up on the D-pad for binoculars to tag enemies. Oh, that's handy. Thank you. I'm sure the game would have taught me that at some point. Though it would have been nice to know there was four enemies there instead of just two. Because mm. I was like, oh, I'll just take these guys out stealthily. Have you played Have you played A Way Out yet? I haven't. We're playing it on Tuesday. Oh, are you, were you waiting for it? Uh, yeah. Have you been playing it? No. I've heard good things. Yeah, it, it, I was it looks warned really there's cool. full frontal male nudity in the first five minutes, so we yeah. should get past that part first. I wanted to reply, that sounds like a, a feature, not a bug to me, but, you know. <laughs> yeah, we are playing A Way Out. Uh, oh, yeah, yeah see? Yeah, we are playing it on Tuesday. We'll be playing it Tuesday. We're actually switching streams with North Carolina uh, next week on Monday, Tuesday. They'll be doing the Monday stream, and Tim's out, so God help us all. Uh, but they'll be doing a stream on Monday at 12, at the normal time. Then we're going to be doing an early stream at 11 a.m. Pacific on Tuesday, which will be A Way Out. Oh, Jesus. Uh, wow. So that... I had no idea. We need to put subtitles on because we can't hear it nearly as well because we don't have headsets. Yep. All of them. I assume this is we gotta kill the whole family. Yes. Uh -huh. Look at how happy they look, though. Yeah. First thing is the family that shoots together stays together. That's right. Here. Mm. Spider Man PS4. No, this is Far Cry 5. Someone said frontal nudity. If it's just butts, I don't care. No, who cares? Yeah, butts fine. I thought there was some. I thought there was some schlong. I was like, well, maybe we don't have schlong on the screen. Might be a little much. But no, thank you. Then we can totally do that. It wouldn't really be a game set in prison if there was a male nudity. I think. Exactly. Not realistic. Uh, Alright, now this is teach you how to actually fight. Mm -hmm. Hold off the cultists. Aw oh, man, I don't want to hold off the cultists. I was gonna know I'm not very good at video games. <laughs> That's not true, I did crush resistance 3. I don't know if you yep. saw me yep. the ending of that game, but. Yep, I was sitting right next to you. I dominated that shit. Yeah, that was impressive. Uh, hey, Ace Toaster. Yeah, maybe I should, like. Not staying. I feel like I'm supposed to stay in here, but I feel like it's not a good idea. Yeah, it feels like you're getting hit a lot more than I'd expect. Given that I can cover. Yeah, play. yeah, exactly. Probably actually was. I was probably forced to get hit there to make me use my kit for the first time. Oh, probably. probably. Oh, oh, that's nice. I'm out of machine gun ammo. How am I getting hit? I don't have another med kit. That's no good. Feels like it's not going very well right now. Hmm. Get in, Rook! Get oh, in the truck. You did it. Is that a bad guy? Yes. Yeah. Oh, okay. yeah. Alright. Your, your bro's waiting outside. I know, I'm trying. Let's go, let's go. Oh, oh shit. Run. Good job, good job. Hey, I made it. Do you recommend PlayStation 4 Pro? Uh, do you have a 4K TV? Uh, I think it's a very easy recommendation if you have a 4K and HDR yeah. TV. Um, because, you know, you just get that. Oh, did I shoot deer? Oh. What is your favorite anime? Oh, God. I like Miyazaki's stuff in general, which I know does is it like. Count? It does count as anime, but I know that's also, like you said, that's like a, 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 a shitty answer for people to play. You don't like anime at all, do you? Yeah, I'm kind of a mild anime fan. Apologies. Uh, I am in the same boat. So. There we go. Dude, this town's huge. It is. A lot of dudes here. Oh, I can't wait for you to get the dog. Oh, That's all yeah. I'm looking forward to. You just want to have the dog just so you can have that tragic so I can moment the of the dog. dog dying. The dog's not going to die. It's going to live forever. If only that was true. Pick up dynamite? Ooh, dynamite gun. Wait, I have dynamite? Yeah. Oh, I should use make for that. Huh? 
Hey, Brian1020. Oh, oh, I no. cooked the dynamite too long here. I'm gonna let you play for a second. Oh, your uh, controller was even red. Oops. Oh, I cooked. Yeah, I cooked that dynamite for far too Haven't long. Haven't you seen the final chase in Terminator One? Yep. The exact same thing, throwing pipe bombs out of a truck, and they got time it perfectly. They invented pipe bombs in Terminator One. Come back. Oops. Yeah, you better get in. You better get in. Alright. I know the buttons now. Uh, let's see. Uh. Oh, well, okay, alright, alright. If you don't have a 4K TV, what's the other main reason? Oh, yeah. If you don't have a 4K TV, the other main reason is extra power for PSVR. Yeah, I guess if you use PSVR, it's another good reason for a pro. Um. Deer. No. Why would I? I'm not a monster like you, I tried. Nothing happened. Dynamite throwing is awkward. Uh, yeah, I just I didn't have the timing quite down. Like, I thought I had more time than I did. I wonder if I actually have to shoot anyone. Uh, Ratchet Extreme X says, will any of you see Ready Player One? Uh, I'm going tomorrow night. I heard Player it's One. really good. I've heard both. I've heard... Actually, I've heard everything. I've heard, like, some people really liked it, some people really didn't like it, some people kind of thought it was okay. Like... I think it has massive problems, but still enjoyed it. I uh, I, I, w I'll, I'll, I have to qualify it. I heard it from Shane that it was really good. And he has questionable taste, taste. in movies. There you go. Yeah, so I'm going to go see it uh, tomorrow night. Yes. Does, yeah, yeah. Right, I'll see it tomorrow night. It'll be interesting. Um, what was the other related? Oh, I went and did the Ready Player One uh, maze. Uh, uh, in Hollywood. Oh Hold god. Hold on triangle if you oh. want to heal. Hold on triangle. Alright, I'm confused. Alright, I got it now. There you go. Boom. Oh, uh, what? One, two... Oh, what? There's a plane shooting at you! There's a got plane! Him. Dude, this is pretty intense. It's really intense. Uh, Terrific uh, opening. Couldn't they just, like, call the National Guard here? I don't know. No, you were going to if, um, they said, like, hold off on calling the National Guard until they see what happens. But then the person you were talking to back at, like, the base is working with them. So, there was yeah, no call exactly. made. Yeah. Corey. We needed the you National You think they didn't Guard. think of that? Come on. Well, at least they explained it. Ooh, ooh. Step Kick King says, was my tweet about herding cats and reference to shenanigans with the insomniac office? No, it was a reference to like a herd of cats that was coming across Burbank and I had to like help them herd them through town. Uh, Corey is a film critic, or master film critic. Yeah, I don't think that's true. No. Only if like the only good movies ever made Definitely. were made in the 80s, then you could consider Corey a master film critic. Corey hasn't even seen Black Panther, so he we can't even. But he didn't see Black Panther, so we can't even judge his like. He, he's not even qualified. It's like it's like there's like stuff to keep your qualification yep. up, but if you haven't seen Black Panther, you're just not qualified. I so agree. you can't comment on movies. And he's had what like two months now. At this yeah, point. like an absurd bad. amount of time. I think it's six weeks, but still. I've invited him, like, multiple times. I know, I know. I, I tried to see it. I tried to walk in to see it, uh -huh. and it was full. There were no seats. You know, maybe we we'll buy him and the Habinski a ticket to go see it yeah. together. We can send them, like, you know, we'll make it happen. I'd, uh, I don't know if I'd put my own money towards that, but I support the idea. Uh... So let's see, uh, oh, for a bunch of rednecks, they are way too heavily armed. Welcome to America, that's what I have to say to that. Um, let's see, uh, after the helicopter doesn't show up in 12 hours, won't they know something is wrong? Uh, I don't know. I don't, I don't know, Does maybe. Maybe they have friends in high places. I haven't played the game. Maybe it is. Maybe they will. Will the sequel be called Ready Player Two? I don't think there's a sequel to the book, is there? I don't know. I didn't even know it was based on a book. Oh yeah. It's based on a novel. Uh, yeah, the the maze in Hollywood's kind of cool. Like just from a like 
It's actually cooler from the outside, but the inside's kind of neat. There's like a hmm. room. Oh, you did it? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, cool. It's not. I would not make a special trip, but if you're in the hood, it's like, and there's not a gigantic line, which it doesn't really seem like there would be anyway. Um, it's worth like 30 minutes of your time. Oh, cool. It's not worth much more than that, but it's worth 30 minutes of your time for free. Um, that was a cool. That was a pretty cool scene. That chase. It's a lot of fun. I didn't have yeah, to yeah, that was pretty. I mean, like the start of the game between like the, the like the landing in the church, arresting yep. the dude, the, the helicopter crash, gone. the escape, the plane no shooting at you. Yeah, like it's pretty, now. pretty good. Yeah, pretty amazing yeah, opening, like, like half an hour. That's solid. Mm -hmm. uh, if you just tuned in, this is uh, Insomniac Live, your show where Goddamn cooks here at Insomniac Games play video games, talk to you. Answer your questions. Uh, we're playing Far Cry 5 today, which is developed by Ubisoft and published. Ubisoft Montreal, Ubisoft Toronto, probably several other Ubisoft offices too, I think. And published by Ubisoft. And it came out yesterday, so it's the new hotness. We're playing on PlayStation 4 Pro. My name's James Stevenson, Community Director, Adam Corleone, Combat Designer on Spider-Man PS4. And, uh, you know, that's what's going on here today. And App Lesh, thank you for the follow on Twitch. Really appreciate that. Uh, Jack Knight said, what is a redneck? We don't have them in the UK. I actually think you probably do. You probably just called something different. Oh, I don't know what the whole term is. Um, yeah, I don't know. Where's Sophie when we need her? You're a worldly guy, Corey. You can you you probably you explain uh, what, a hill, what a UK hillbilly is. Oh, 18 like, uh, million people turned into the Roseanne reboot last night. Oh, wow. Did you add, answer it? What did you say back there? Some fresh clothes. Wait, now I'm sidetracked by the Roseanne reboot. <laughs> <laughs> you didn't know Roseanne was rebooted? Like, they literally renewed Is Roseanne. Roseanne in it? Oh, yeah. It's like the original family. They wow. brought it back. I did not watch this last night, but apparently 18 million people did. So that tells you who rednecks are right there. I'm just joking. I actually, I think it's funny now with the era of streaming and stuff. I think like TV shows like that over time, they stopped becoming must-watch television. Mm. And when you had to watch TV every day, or you, you had to think. watch it live or set up a videotape, you know, people wouldn't do that as much. Now in the DVR streaming era, I think there's a lot of like older shows that maybe like their audiences had slipped off. They would be totally, totally... Um, like would never have gotten canceled. Like sure. they would have stayed on. They would have stayed on the air because more people would have watched them. And like they like the old rating system wasn't the way of doing it. Do you mind if I just random? Yeah, do whatever. Although I'm a little sad you're not doing the America tank. Sorry, it's America. Oh look, Why Spider Man combat roll? looks just like Batman's. LOL. <laughs> you're not watching it close enough. Sure. <laughs> that's that's funny. That's pretty good. You, incorrect, sir. Incorrect. <laughs> and besides, you guys have seen like this much. Batman doesn't have webs. That's true. Batman isn't an acrobatic improviser. There you go. Batman doesn't Anyone use the environment. Me? This is good. You found All these things this. Batman doesn't do. Just Batman saying. don't. Just saying. Uh. Let's see. What's happening up top? It ain't good. Little I could gather. Yeah, I don't think redneck is like for a white working class person in rural areas anymore. I think it has more like a certain derogatory term. I don't know. I'm from Nebraska. I don't consider Nebraskans to be rednecks generally speaking. Like you kind of have to all. It's like you have to sort of embrace certain things to like fully go redneck. Like, but just like someone who's like a farmer isn't an automatic redneck in my opinion. Sure, it's probably true. Um, oh, someone says the Roseanne reboot was hilarious and heartwarming. We must watch. Just take the gun from my safe. We need to Does Peter hit the gym often? I don't think so, right? He doesn't really need to, right? Yeah. I don't know. I don't know what in our lore if he... Like, I mean, he'd have to be lifting, like, all the weights in the entire place, right? Yeah, right? It wouldn't really matter to him. It's, he yeah. has to, like, lift the... Just, yeah, you're probably right. Probably right. Spiders don't go to the gym. You're right. Uh, Let's see... Would you do a Marvel Avengers game? No, Square Enix is making that game. It's even announced. So why would we make it? Uh, Can't wait to see more of that. 
I'm really excited. Yeah, me Super too. talented studio. Me too. I'm sure. And I'm really excited to see Avengers, like, in less than a month. Oh, it's that's actually right. under a month away. Wow. So that's very, very exciting. Um, Favorite um, character in the Avengers? Are they all considered Avengers? Or do you have to be, like, inducted into it? Well, I mean, like, honestly, for part of me for Infinity War, I mean, like, Spider-Man's way up there. Mm -hmm. And for Infinity War, I'm really excited about the Guardians being involved. I do like Iron Man quite a bit, but I also like Cap. I like, Iron Man and Cap both are great. I don't know, there's so many good ones. This is really hard. Don't make me. You have to rescue civilians, all right. All right. Is there more? Do you press X or something? They're talking to me. Oh, I see. Destroy cult properties. Well, that looks looks like there's a giant flammable tank in that thing. Like that just says, "Shoot me and watch this whole spire explode." Okay. Look, see, Far Cry Five knows the resistance is where it's at too. There you go. Welcome to Tutorial Island. <laughs> what date does Avengers release over here? They moved it up to the twenty seventh. Uh. Which means it actually comes out on the night of the 26th. Mm. Um, because movies come out a day early here, like now. They used to come out at midnight, now they come out, and then they start coming out at like 10 p.m. And the movie, the, the, the film industry has just kept moving that up. Right. And actually, like Last Jedi, and I imagine Avengers probably come out at 6 p.m., even for the first screenings. Or they'll have some like 30 second giveaway and charge $40 for the tickets. That's you're, my guess. You ready for it? You give him the boot. Someone? I like how you do have a leg you can actually kick with. Don't you have guns? Yes. There you go. Oh, you have a knife too, with... and Molotovs, but it looks like you don't have any of those actually. You may want to be careful about shooting anyone. Yeah. All right. But though that looks like a quest giver if he has green, right? He looks like he's doing bad. Oh things. no! What's he like doing? Oh, alerted. I gotta help him. Oh, I'm going in guns blazing. Oh no! I'm gonna. Oh no! You want to knock this guy oh, out? Oh shit! Go, how, do you remember how to crouch? Uh, 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 or circle. And then uh, R3 to oh, knock no. someone down. Oh, no, don't turn around. Go, 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 go. Do the takedown, do the takedown, do the takedown. Can you wait till they execute that guy and then... No, there's no, no way. Oh, take her gun, take her gun, take her gun. But now, uh, weapon wheel. We love weapon wheels here, don't we? All right. Uh, all right, sneak up, sneak up, sneak up. Take down. Oh, that was cool. Yeah, that was a fun animation. Loot, loot, loot. Give me the loot. Come on, we'll help you, please. Oh God, is that meat or? Hmm. Oh, you gotta, you gotta liberate that dude. <laughs> I like how it actually the liberate prompt come up, came up while he's beating him up. I wonder if you could liberate him while the guy was still punching him. Like, oh, yeah, yeah. Just walk up. It's like getting punched. <laughs> and you're like, like, hold on, I'm gonna untie him while he's punching him. He punches him again. You untie him. Coin, all the money. Thank you, thank you. All right. Uh, nice dream. Thank you for the follow. And John Tech, thank you for the follow. Um, uh, okay. People all talking about getting their Infinity War tickets and their theaters being sold out. Do you have your tickets? For I now? don't. Mm. Slacker. I know. Um, I'm gonna yeah. do the same thing. I honestly, I don't have a, I don't have a good excuse for why I don't. I wish I could have one, but I don't. I have my. I think IMAX tickets for Friday. I, think, I believe uh, they shot the whole movie in IMAX. Oh, cool. I believe. I don't know if that's true. A bunch of us were going to try and go to uh, Universal. Yeah. Um, but then we like missed out on the opening days. So I think we're going to try and go like the following week or something. Nice. Liberate Dutch's Island. Is there a map? Uh, I was in... Yep, there we go. Uh, wouldn't be an Ubisoft game, open world game without a map. Yep. Oh wait, so this island. Okay, so it's probably all the blue stuff on the yeah. map are all the objectives. Huh. Each of those, like, okay. or maybe it's a diamond because I think the guy oh, had a diamond. That's maybe where I there's, a, but there's also a hole. Yeah, look at the diamond. I think. Mm. Pepper Perfect. stash. Oh, maybe not. No. Okay. Lookout tower. All right, I guess I'll go there. Yeah, the fog. Uh, Kranzi's talking about the atmospherics, and they oh, are really, awesome. really good. A spare ticket if I want to go to Scotland. Thanks. I might take you up on that. I actually did go to Europe to see Guardians of the Galaxy a week early. Did you really? Guardians of the Galaxy too. Yeah. Nice. I love Guardians. Yeah. James Gunn was very impressed. Literally on Twitter. 
but then he was upset because he's like, oh, no, you just ruined our opening weekend. And I was like, I know, oh. dude, it's cool. I have IMAX <laughs> tickets for opening weekend in the U.S. too. Nice. And he's like, sweet. It's, that's all good then. Oh, here it comes. I don't think it's a bad guy. You don't think so? No, I think that's... Yeah, he's green. See? Yeah. Oh, why'd you punch him? He's... Oh, you're right. He's, uh, he's my friend. You're right. Sorry. Sorry. Come back. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I told you not to do it. Where's the hug button? Take him out. Here. Don't him. Don't. Is this the hug button? Oh. Do not kill innocent civilians. <laughs> Man, you're messing up my save. You're messing up my save. Oh, did it just reset? No, no, it didn't. That was just you. Okay. Wait, switch over with L. Or go to the map and go R1, L1. All right. You maybe will like do the objective thing. Oh. Oh, so that's tracked. Okay, I just have to go around doing stuff. Yeah. Okay. All right. <laughs> it's like the little yeah tutorial island. Oh, there's a diamond down there. What does the diamond mean? Uh, I don't know. Oh, look, I have a zip line. That's yeah, you awesome. put a zip line down. Okay, what does that say? Uh, read. Boathouse, you didn't leave me the key. Well, there you go. Okay, oh, I see. Oh. Find a way in. Well, there's gotta be a way to nice. blow your way in here, right? Bad Samaritan. I was just trying to, like, ask for forgiveness. Did you even do what you were supposed to do at the radio tower? Don't know. Find or, a way into the boathouse. All right. There's probably is like a there probably was like a viewpoint type thing or something you could have I think done. So, if and I was a you, video game designer, what would I do here? You it's got to be. Oh, like, I swim. No, I swim. Case, I swim. Case. Oh, got it. Oh, and that, duh. It's like you're a video game designer <laughs> or something. Oh, I can't open. Oh, there it is. Oh, so you gotta activate the power, which is somewhere in here. Yep. Oh, oh I've got sparking. Yep. What a visual cue that is. Oh, there you go. Good design, Ubisoft. Well done. So now that should have unflooded the area up the hill, so okay. you now you can use the key to get back out. There, there was a chest you could. Maybe you can't. There you go. Oh, what's in there? Yeah, nice rifle spot. ammo and Good. arrows. Arrows. Ooh. All right, we're in business. There's a on the well. It's fine. Whatever. We don't need to get the ammo. You now you go back up the hill. Look at the god hill. rays. I know, man. The atmosphere is a killer. Any flat earthers in the chat? Well, Corey, <laughs> I don't know what you're trying to accomplish, but I'm interested to see where it goes. <laughs> Someone said, "Wait, uh, wow, legit! I didn't even find that key when I played because you weren't playing with video game designers. That's there why." Oh, 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 you gotta like get the pump going, right? Inside search zone. How much oxygen do you have though with the real? Unlimited? Probably. No way. Oh, is it, is it shrinking? What's going on? I don't oh, know. Oh, yeah. Is, is it? Maybe? I don't know. Maybe? I don't know. I can't tell. Okay, now you got more. But there's something in there. Find a way to access the bunker. Right. Did I not just access it? No, oh, turn the pump on. Yep. There oh, you go. Look at that. It's yellow. Oh, yeah. Classic video game color of interactivity. There you go. It can stand out from the environment. So good. That we're giving free free lessons on uh, game design and visual design. Corey, I hope you're paying attention. Uh, no, I was thinking about the flattery. Thinking about what? <laughs> Did the flat earth thing ever go anywhere? Everyone said they're not. Uh -huh. Am I tweeting on the Insomniac page? No, but I was looking at uh, I was looking at some Twitter notifications. Money in the broken safe on the ground. We all know the earth is cone-shaped. Hmm. Yeah, okay, that's an interesting philosophy. Thoughts, Corey? Cone oh, shape? see, there you go. Look, look to your left, there's money. Uh, well, I'm a big fan of that movie, Coneheads. <laughs> What are the the silver things look like they're money too or casing something? Oh my god, I'm so wealthy now. Yeah, you're in the money. 
You gotta dry the money out though. Oh. It's a little soggy right now. That's true. Oh, you can craft. Nice. So there's a bench around here. No, no, no. It said it was in the weapon wheel. There's a whole. Oh, okay, tool okay, tip. okay. If you hold down L1, there's like a part in the lower right, maybe or. Well, shit. I don't know. Actually, no, never. Uh oh. Mind. You just wasted a grenade. Let's test him. It works. All right. Well, now you don't have a grenade. Casing for crafting. Uh, who writes the Insomniac tweets? Uh, several people. A lot of them are mine, though. Quite a few of them are mine. Oh, Is Corey allowed right. on the Insomniac thing? No. God, no. <laughs> <laughs> no, I'm inappropriate. Yeah. Oh, look, you got a lot oh, of Oh, my these. God. Yeah. yeah you may want to scout this out with your uh -oh, binoculars uh -oh. to mark these guys. Uh, Can you mega, throw a in there? mega cousin. <laughs> oh, there's you gotta like try and. I can't, cause I. You, oh, that's what you mean. What? You're so. What? So sassy, Corey. He asked if I could throw a grenade in there, but I can't, cause I no, just there's least of it. Yeah, you, yeah, yeah. There you go. You know, it'd be really useful right now. A grenade. A grenade would be really useful. But you don't have one. Uh oh. Did you guys still see the weapon wheel? Did Ratchet and Clank start that? I don't think Ratchet and Clank started the weapon wheel, but we were one of the earlier games that used one. It's a good question, actually. I don't know. I don't think we claim to invent the weapon wheel, though, by any means. I'm pretty sure there was other games before us. But the exact etymology of weapon wheels in video games, I do not know. Okay, knock the first guy out. Yep. Do it. Ooh. Okay. All right, I'm gonna now, liberate you, friend. No, no, no. You want to get the guy who's yeah, gonna yeah. beat up first. <laughs> You're an angel. Thank you. You're welcome. They don't look dangerous. <laughs> okay, now go get that. Oh, watch out! Oh, liberated. See, there you what go. Fireworks. Well, the fireworks. But well, the fireworks are quite the Pavlovian little like. <laughs> Like, like, he, boom, <laughs> you win, the winner is you! And it kind of makes sense with America, fireworks. Oh, it's Silver Lake Conservation Area. Hey, that's where I live. I live in Silver Lake. I've never felt happier playing a video game. That was pretty sweet, actually. That was such a Pavlovian thing. Like, the. That was, like, the whole reason they were talking about why loot boxes are so addictive is because right. of, like, all the, like, yep, like totally. slot machine, like... What are you doing? He's a civilian! <laughs> Fucking stop killing people! He had a quest for you or some shit! I feel like I have, I've established, like, my character. What is going on? And it would be weird the if I didn't keep kicking The game said in giant red if text, do not kill them. civilians! I'm just beating him up. Why? He like had a little prompt of his head to talk to you about something, and you. Decided he seemed to... like he had gotten used to getting beat up by the other guy. I didn't want to like change his lifestyle. Oh my goodness! I, I let him live. It's fine. What would you tell Ubisoft if we were they were watching right now? We're sorry that Adam keeps killing your pedestrians. <laughs> That's what we'd tell them. Uh... Your game didn't deserve this. Oh, save the resistance member. Look, there's someone. You got to sneak around though. Oh, I'm gonna go through the water. Oh, you're like good. an alligator. Yep. Watch out, there's a uh, dude uh -oh. watching from the pier. Alright, I'll al alligator him first. Uh oh. Did he no, you're good, you're good. Oh, okay, okay. <laughs> James is triggered. Yeah, yeah, I am. Because <laughs> it was like the first one. It's like, man, the guy has. Some oh, oh, no, God. what did you do? What did you do? Alright, alright. No, you're fine. Oh. Dude, he took that bullet like a champ. Oh, I love how he fell into the water too afterwards. You should have a PUBG stream where you create a custom server. That's a good idea. Can you create custom servers on Xbox and just have a hundred of your closest friends play? That would be kind of fun. You could do it on Fortnite. I don't know if you knew it on Fortnite either, but yeah, like a hundred Insomniac fans all playing PUBG against us would be pretty oh, entertaining. Or you could hire him? the guy. Yo, I just you saved around. you. Why would I have to pay you? To be that fair, he sense. does owe you like a free. No! Alright, that's it, that's it, that's it. That's it. Just... It's fine. It's fine. Ah, Jack Knight. This is my last day tomorrow at school. Then I'm off for 15 days. Well, I hope you're gonna play some good games, Jack Knight. All right. Oh, he's coming with me to fight. All right. I hope he still wants to help me after I punched him. 
guns for higher controls. Did you read that? Or did yes, you I pressed left. Left. I saw a left arrow. I'll tell you exactly what to do. All right. Oh wow, you just decided to light this place up. Yeah. It's time to fight. Uh oh. All right, get in there, guy. What is he doing down there? No, took cover. Seems to be doing well. What was his name? Dave Thorpe? Yep. Oh, oh what a headshot! Got what him. a headshot! Got Dave Thorpe, don't get killed! He's fine. He's climbing. Come on, Dave Thorpe! Oh. Make up for. I was joking about that the other day, how, uh. Uh, oh, there's like the guns for hire tutorial, basically. Once you hired him, then he immediately gave you the tutorial. What is happening here? Uh, that's their fart bucket. <laughs> so, oh, look, 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 it looks like you're... There's some weird, like, <laughs> chromatic aberration there. It looked like there was, right? After Right after you smelled that? Can you uh, go back and smell it? it some more? Yeah. It looked like there was like some weird blurriness in your vision after you smelled it. But, Oh yeah, oh, look, yeah, see, there's totally some chromatic every yeah, totally. That is right. funny. But I was like, whoa, it looked like it looked like there's some weird shit going on there. I'm just gonna sit here and huff the huff this the rest of the stream. Well, apparently Secret of Mana had a weapon wheel or wing command. Yeah, kind of, I guess Secret of Mana sort of does. Maybe that's a good example. But but I mean in Ratchet it pauses or slows down gameplay. Um I was joking with someone about how I think we were talking at GDC. Uh, and actually, I don't even know who this person was. They were hanging out with Michael McWhorter, and we were talking, and it was a very nerdy conversation about Star Wars and Harry Potter. It was pretty funny, but I also was pretty tired and maybe a little buzzed at that point. But I was talking about how uh, we were talking about how um, I was joking that you know, like how the whole Chewbacca, like I don't know if you know Chewbacca, like in the old expanded universe, had a life debt to Han Solo. That was the whole thing, like he had a life debt. Whatever, which even came into play when Jar Jar has the life debt to Qui Gon. Oh, watch out! Someone was spotting you, by the way, to the right. And they have. Oh, look! There's that tower you got to blow up. You may want to sneak in because there's someone spotting you right now. Oh, dive! Oh no! Too late! Now they're gonna be shooting at you through the water. I've got friends, or friend. Um. Anyway. But like that's very quietly like gone now. The whole like, idea that Chewbacca had a life debt to Han. Mm -hmm. Anyway, but that was in the old Star Wars universe. Like he was indebted that. with his life. Interesting. So they must be like making drugs or something, right? Like, yeah. Dude, you took out the trench coat guy. Uh oh. Oh look, yeah, you're definitely in the range of drugs. You explode. That thing like tears through its clip. Yeah. It's Scarecrow's fear box. Uh, oh, nice. I shot his hand. Is that it? I think you gotta blow the thing yeah, up. Yeah, yeah. I would just shoot oh. that. I think it's gonna go. Got yeah! It. Got it. Got 75 RPs. Is there a gun ammo in that case right below your feet? Mm. It looked like an ammo box. I guess not. Oh well. No, it's in the cooler next to it. Guys. Uh, Brian 1020, I like how this is installed. I don't know what was going on there. It's possible. What about the toolbox? There you go. There you go. There's some ammo. Because it's yellow. Oh, there you go. Yeah, that makes sense. The green smoke is called bliss. Oh. Jack Knight, this is never, remind me to never shave my armpits again. And I'm just like, okay, cool. Oh, May not. Oh, look at that. Look at that. People trying to be <laughs> cute. You're going to get yourself off and blocked on my friends if <laughs> you do that. So just warning you. Maybe it was worth it. Maybe it was worth it, but you will get yourself blocked. That's all. <laughs> oh, it's Radio Tower. All right. All right. There's probably guys here, right? Yeah, probably. Usually there's bad guys around points of interest in Ubisoft Open World games. Oh, oh is there a ladder to climb? Yes, you get to go all the way up. Yeah, dog. Moving on up. 15 seconds of fame. <laughs> oh, Nicholas N A J M oh, says yeah. I worked on this hey, game. Nick. Well, thank you for working on it and making something really cool that we're enjoying playing right now. Quite Nick. a bit, actually. I am enjoying this a lot. Yeah, Nick is an awesome, awesome level designer at Ubisoft, obviously. Oh, do you actually know who it is? Yes. Oh, cool. Listen to what Dutch says once you're up there. All right. 
I sent you a friend request, James, but you didn't accept. Uh, sorry. I, I'm bad about accepting friend requests on PlayStation. Yeah, so far the game is really cool. Oh, level up! Crap. Level up! Oh, you liberated the island. You did it. Where's my fireworks? Nick, where's the fireworks at? Yeah, I missed the fireworks. Like, I just don't feel any sense of accomplishment now that I don't get them. We well, you get to now do the zip line. Although we're supposed to listen to the Dutch up here. Can I reveal any plans after we release the Spider-Man? No, we're focused on Spider-Man. We need game testers. Uh, I don't know if we have QA positions right now or not. You should go to our website and our careers page, because that's where all our open jobs are. And if we do, then it's there. Uh, all of our open jobs are there. Wow. What? That's that's how much? Holy oh, oh. Wow. I like how his children have like all disciplized the region. So like that whole island is like that little carve out. Dang, I'm gonna put like so much time into this game. How many hours did you put into this game? Uh, I'm gonna say if it's like every other Ubisoft game that I have beaten, I'm gonna say 30 to 40. Sounds about right. Pan to the east. Pan to the east? Oh, you probably have to like wait this region. So those are like his three kids. Maybe. Pan to the west. Don't worry, I'm. I'm not going to get you to climb towers throughout the whole county. Self-reference to Ubisoft Tower Show. That's pretty funny. Oh, that's funny. Well, you know, they, they know it. So you have full resistance points there. So basically you have to build up a resistance to actually take them down. Or a trigger or something. Got it, got it. This map oh, wow. is awesome. Holy crap. Oh, that's really cool. The topographic 3D map is rad. Oh, oh, oh is that like a is that like a Christ the Redeemer kind of statue type? Oh yeah, thing? did you not see it on the opening? No, no, I I, I guess I didn't process it fully, uh, yeah, but yeah. it's totally like yeah, that. it's like this massive Rio de Janeiro yep, exactly. like Christ the Redeemer. That's pretty neat. Totally. Alrighty, ready, Corey? Ready to zip line. Corey yeah. falls asleep back there. You got awfully quiet, Corey. Nah, I'm here. You sure? I'm zoning out. Oh, there's there's. I've right, been there. awake since five today. What? Oh, you did come in early. That's right. What did you do that for? I mean, the five part, not the coming early. Yeah. Was there any particular reason you got well, up? That's at why? Five? Yeah. Coming early. Oh. Well, you got here at seven, right? Did you get here earlier than seven? Uh, I got here. Yeah, seven. <laughs> Look at the responses. They're so delayed. <laughs> so okay. All right. <laughs> So you live 15 minutes away, so we know you left your house at 6.45. Yep. So what were you doing between 5 a.m. and 6.45 a.m., if I may ask? I made breakfast. <laughs> you made breakfast? What did you make for breakfast? I'm picking up something new out of Holland Valley. It's a broadcast. Peanut butter and jelly. Okay, so you made a peanut butter jelly sandwich and you ate it. That takes approximately... I'm going to give you some credit. I'll give you, say, 20 minutes. Yeah, sure. I'm going to let you have, like, 15 minutes of snooze time, <laughs> followed by, like, a 30-minute shower. <laughs> we still have about 40 minutes of your morning that's unaccounted for at this point. So yeah, what's going on? What there? you were up to, what's man. Going on over there, Corey? When I wake up, I, I have to get up when I wake up. You could be free for If I lay in bed, then I'll get too tired to get up later. So I woke up at 5, I had to get up at 5. But I mean, what but did that you do? You, I know you made some breakfast. I know you got ready and took a shower. But there still feels like there's a large gap. Like, did you just like screw around on the internet? I was freaking out about stocks too, so I was just watching the stocks. Okay, now we know. You were up with the market, is what you were saying. Did the market tank again today? Yeah. It did really. Yeah. No, today is fine. Yesterday it tanked. I mean, it was well, kind of bad, but yesterday was worse. Yes. Good for you, Corey. Corey is our resident uh, yes. stockbroker. Is he really? Yeah. He's, huh. he's pretty. Yes. He's got some. Uh, he's got some mad stock skills. Corey's hiding something. I completely agree. Not lately. <laughs> no, yeah. Well, you, no one's had mad stock skills lately. You will be cleansed. Uh, how's God of War development coming, Corey? That's the wrong Corey. That's a different Corey. Corey. Different people. <laughs> Corey does not invest in Bitcoin either. Uh, oh, and I didn't got a war. Go gold, didn't they say that? I thought they said got a war. Yep. Went gold. Yeah, that's what I thought. Yeah, I'm trolling. 
He's making a joke. I mean, it's out in like, what? Three weeks? Yeah. Three? So yeah, three. 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 Oh, you're right. That's why. I was like, that doesn't make sense. It should have been, it would have been three weeks from yesterday, but there's more than 21 days between now and then, so it's 23 days. Yeah, I better have gotten gold. You just love wasting ammo, don't you? I mean, you gotta, like, shoot. You gotta do oh, something. Oh, I like how they drop you down here right to a motorboat, and then, like, here's the other thing. Look at the bright red tower right across the way. Like, blow me up. Can I hit it from here? No, I don't think you can. Oh, you got a story mission, though. Or getting his rub nose rubbed in his mess. Yeah, we're just teasing. Sleepy Cory's pretty funny. Sleepy. <laughs> Here comes Treble has followed. Thank you for that. Here comes Treble. It would have been cooler if it was Here Comes Trebek, though. Here Comes Treble is a reference from The Office. I got it. Don't care. It's not a Jeopardy reference. <laughs> Actually, there was someone on Jeopardy last night. I... Oh, that's right. I heard on one of those streams that you're going to go try out in person, right? Well, Did yeah, you do that? No, it's a few weeks still. Oh, okay, I'm, okay. I'm in study mode. Oh. Um, watch out. That's probably... Oh, yeah. Yeah, that's a bad guy. But I appreciate the way you just, like, walked right up and took him down. Yeah. Uh, someone on Jeopardy last night who got this, both Daily Doubles and Final Jeopardy. And the last three clues... Successfully answered both daily doubles and a two thousand dollar clue as the last three clues to take the lead, and successfully answered Final Jeopardy and lost Oh because they didn't bet enough on all three of those things. Wow! And actually, I didn't think the first bet was terrible, given like they could have lost control of the board and someone else could have gotten a daily double afterwards. Mm. You don't want to get too far behind if you bet big. But on the second one, it was like, well, you know, you, there's no more daily doubles, so you can bet big. Gotta have some confidence. Uh, uh, confidence. I didn't think it was possible for a contestant on Jeopardy to get both, to answer both daily doubles in, in double Jeopardy correctly, and, then and final Jeopardy correctly, and lose. Wow. Just some poor Maybe poor. There's a green icon of a gun to your I got a Jeopardy question for you. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> this dinosaur from the Cretaceous period of the Hadrosaur family is named means helmet lizard. I don't know. Mm -hmm. The helmet lizard the giveaway to that, and it's whatever... I know there's that hard-headed lizard. I know that I can, like, picture it, but I don't know the name. While you're thinking... I, um, I, I, don't, I, I won't know it. I can't pull the name out of my head. Ubisoft it's... Toronto is responsible for the North Region, a.k.a. Jacob's Region. Oh, got it. Oh, interesting. Is that how they did it? So, like, the different studios did That's different right, regions? Uh, yeah, yeah. I know, like, because Ubisoft break or, sorry, uh, got Assassin's Creed breaks stuff up like that. Like, I think, like, Singapore did the, the naval stuff for, like, um... Go, I kinda, oh, yeah, no, it's just, that four. makes sense to me, like, in some level of, like, breaking out, like, because it's, like, a completely different control set, right? Like, right. So, and I know, like, the Star Wars game that EA was publishing was doing that too, right? Like, yeah, that's right. Like, um, like, they were going to do, like... Criterion the, did, like, the space battles. Well, that happened with Battlefront, and then they were doing the same thing with uh, Amy's game, where supposedly there was, like, this big space... Com if you read Schreier's article, there's, like, a space component that was happening elsewhere um, in Canada. Uh, but it is interesting when you have a game like this. But I think it kind of makes sense, because then that team can sort of own their area and yeah. make it unique to them. Totally. But it's it's just so like, cool how they, like... How they can do all that in tandem, right? Yeah, that is neat. Um, what have you played? Any Diplosaurus? Oh, huh? not a Diplosaurus, right? I put the answer there. I wrote it. Oh, oh what? it's a Cory, Cory Thesaurus. Is that really true? That's real. Okay. Yeah. yeah. All right. All right. Because the the helmet lizard is like the Corinthian helmet. All right. Ah, it's a Corythorus. Got it. All right. That's good to know. Thank you. Now, if that comes up on Jeopardy, you will lose your shit. <laughs> did you play any of the? Uh, I saw in the chat. <laughs> did you play any of the Telltale Batman games? No, I didn't. Did you? No. Corey, did you? Uh, I played Walking Dead and no. Wolf Among Us and some of Guardians of the Galaxy, and I need to actually go and finish Guardians of the Galaxy at some point. Uh, do you? Those are like those to me feel like awesome iPad games. Like, or like actually, I love them on my Switch. Yeah. Yeah, really good Switch games. That. Totally. Uh, like it's hard. It's hard for me to pick those games over. 
I mean, like, I want to play them. I just want to play them portably. I like mm. want to play them when I'm on a plane. That's fair. Or something. That's fair. Uh, and I did like that. Like, well, several of them I played on my laptop on like uh, on planes. I like how you just like storm through like an outpost. Like, you just ran right through the. Got it. Got it. Um, I think someone said, "What's your favorite Netflix show?" Oh, Daredevil is good. Uh, oh God. Jeff's Table is really good. Uh, Ugly Delicious is excellent right now. Um, I've heard good things about The Crown, but I haven't watched it. Though that might be a BBC. No, I don't think it's a BBC show. I don't think so. Yeah, because it'd be more censored if it's a BBC show. I think. Uh, is this Firewatch? Yes, yeah, I know, right? It, it did kind of look like Firewatch for a second. Then you are in a fire lookout right now. Any game with trees and an outpost is Firewatch. I like how within like five seconds of this game, there's more violence than there is in Firewatch. I think I got him. Music died. <laughs> Spider-Man comes G in June or October? Question mark. This is Ace Tosto. Uh, we haven't announced any release time frame within 2018. Stay tuned. Oh, Ratchet and Clank 42069 was triggered by that, unfortunately. Which part? Someone asking us about a more specific time. Oh, yeah, yeah. Spider -Man. yeah. Uh, I promise we aren't going to announce. Love and Master the of None. Date. Master of None is great too. Master of yeah. None is really yeah. good. And I have watched the first season of Love, and I never went back. Hmm. I haven't but seen it. I'm pretty sure see things. I see. Um, what's her name? Oh God. Uh, Britta, Britta on Community. Um, oh, what is her name? Uh, the actress. She played Britta on Community, and she's the star of Love. Um, good God. Jillian, Jillian Jacobs? Yes, Jillian Jacobs. Uh, Jillian Jacobs, uh, like, she's a parent. She, I think she lives somewhere around me and is also foodie-ish oh, cool. because I see her at several restaurants. I oh, see her multiple fun. times at restaurants that I go to, which I usually go to foodie-ish spots. Very cool. Um, and a couple of my, I've seen her several times at one place I oh, really We saw like. Pat and Oswald at the Chinese restaurant. What? When was that? Hey, bud. Really? Justin and I did. Uh, you didn't tell me about that. That's awesome. Really? At Century Dragon? That that's one fun. by Porto's. Yeah, yeah. That, that's awesome. I guess he likes Empire Shrimps. Um, I liked that uh, that wrestling show they had recently, the women's Oh, one. Uh, was that Bright? Uh, Glow. Glow. That was a good Glow. one. Glow. Yeah. <laughs> I feel like Corey's obviously listening to us. He's got three seconds delay. He's <laughs> it's so on a stream fun. delay. It's fine. Oh, yeah, sorry. <laughs> that's, why was, that's, why, that's why you're taking so long to respond to us, because you're responding to the recorded versions of us, not the live in the room version. <laughs> oh my goodness, I'm like, it's so funny. Uh, glow, that's right. All right. Yeah, I'll do one headphone now so I can do it. <laughs> it was like we'd be saying stuff and you wouldn't respond for hours. Like, man, what is going on over there? <laughs> I trust the audio. We got a, one, of our, one of our plans is to eventually get Corey, like, get a little green screen background and put a camera on the person no, I would. and, like, a microphone so that person can chime in from back there. I'd pitch in for a Corey cam. Yeah. We don't I'm have to pitch have my there. backdrop of the green screen. I'm going to be flying over Agrabah. <laughs> no, no. We're going to cut. Our, it's going to basically alpha channel you out, the person, of whatever's up against can it, and then this? you can put it on the other. So, like, you can have, like, on one side the couch and everyone, and then on the, like, other corner if that person's talking or wants to, you can like lay in. I don't know, we can talk about it more. Oh, I, like um, the whoopsie guy in Mortal Kombat? Yeah, kind of. Oh, did you just steal a plane? I, I didn't steal it, I found it, but yes. Is it, was it yours? I don't know. I don't know the full lore behind the game. Maybe it is. Uh, are you looking forward to Isle of Dogs? Uh, very much. Actually, I have to wait for my girlfriend to come back in time to see it then. Uh, Maybe she see that and she can. Honestly. Uh, I love Wes Anderson movies. So. Yeah, definitely. Are you just like new character found Mary May Fairgrave? You found her right when you flew right over her. Can you just land it right on the street? Yes. I want to see you land. All right. Because you know the whole rule is fly yes land now. I don't know that rule. Yeah, Indiana Jones. Oh, you know, okay. I never knew you knew how to fly a plane, Junior. Fly yes, land <laughs> no. Which that is the tricky part of flying is landing. Corey, do you know anything about Indiana Jones? Yeah. Uh, oh shit! I oh, never hit in it in the second one. Uh huh. In the Temple of Doom. Uh huh. That is. Uh, 
Got filmed it. in Sri Lanka in Sagiria, and I climbed Sagiria. Nice. There. Cool. Do you like that prequel? The prequel? You mean, uh, wait. Temple of Doom is a prequel. Oh, Temple of Doom is a prequel? Yeah, you didn't know that? Yikes. I don't know if I've even watched them all back to back to back. I've watched them, like, throughout my childhood, like, way out of order and stuff. Like, I did that with Star Wars, too. I saw Return of the Jedi first, and I, I didn't see the other ones the way they did. Uh, they have an Isle of Dog exhibition in London, which I'm going to tomorrow. They have the actual models from the movie, so it's cool. actually playing 42 at 60. Yeah, that sounds awesome. That sounds really cool. I love Wes Anderson. Movies. Yeah, yeah, I'm very, very excited. Probably gonna see if you can if you can clear this or not. I am probably the last major thing. doing far better in this game than uh, Wolfenstein. Oh, oh, gross. What does the sign on the hill say? It's like Hollywood. Yeah, it says Hollywood. But isn't it Montana? Is uh, that a bug? Probably. I don't think it's a bug. I, I think it's, it's a bug. There's a lot of dudes out here. The music guy kind of intense. Yeah. Really. Oh yeah. god. Just as I was complimenting myself, I was patting myself on the back. That happens. Do you want to try one more time? I'm going to try. I'll try to get through there. I don't know. This is the type of stuff that murders me. Like, I'm not... Adam joins the Red Arrows when... What's the Red Arrows? Corey? A1, oh, thank you for the follow, right. and... What are you talking about? I don't know. Uh, I don't know. And Antic65, thank you for the follow. Kron Z says, even I haven't flown a plane yet, so you just did that right off the bat. There you go. Oh, nice! Oh, God. Wow! Good flying. Almost. That was a good recovery. I wish I had guns, though. Yeah. I think I could straight the shit out of these fuckers. Sorry, I'm getting a little animated. Sorry, we're into it. That's good. Well, that was that was kind of a landing. Yeah, we did fine. Hey, welcome fans. See, that's for all you guys in the Twitch chat right here. <laughs> welcome. The red arrows are a stump. Oh, well, there you, you got any orange slices? Well, thank you very much. No orange slices? No Capri Suns? <laughs> oh. What? Do you remember the Capri Sun commercial where the guy turned into liquid metal like the T-1000? Uh, yes. Yes, I that do. That was so cool. Which basically hey, nice was... story, Corey. That yeah. is cool. This is a good story. <laughs> I promise I'm not still upset about that. Oh, oh shit. Pulled an atom. That was good. Did it not explode? No, I don't know what that was even. Sully, Sully would approve of that ace flying, yeah. He Look would. at that coordination. That's right, Captain Sullenberger. That movie is actually, if you haven't watched Sully, it's pretty good. That's a little over dramatized from the actual, like, basically like the post events were dramatized to make it seem more. Um, Can we dare the Insomniac team on a live stream? What does that mean, Corey? What? Can we dare the Insomniac team? Is that like truth uh, or dare? Yeah. Yes. All right, Corey. Corey approved it. Get him. Punch him. Punch him. No, kill him. All right, you got. Throw a punch. Right the Yep. What's wrong with him? Get up. Get up. Get up. Uh oh. Uh oh. Shit. Oh, is this? I think this is the E3 demo. It looks like the environment, but not the same setting. Right. Oh, you're on the fire. E3. Oh, that didn't go very well. All right. Well, that's probably it for us today. Yeah, that was a good one. Yeah, it's pretty good. Ah, uh, Far Cry. It's sweet. You should check it out if you want a new game because it's out right now, and it can keep you busy. Maybe all the way till God of War comes out. There you go. Uh, and it's available now from Ubisoft. Lots of different Ubisoft studios. Thanks to what was his name? Nick. Nick. Thanks, Nick from Ubisoft, who worked on it. Stop in, said hello on the stream. Yeah. Uh, it seems really fun. We barely scratched the surface. Man, this, uh, there's just it seems like there's so much. Yeah, there's a lot of people here awesome. who are very excited about playing it. Uh, I think tomorrow North Carolina's back, 11 a.m. Pacific for Feral Rights. 
which they'll be playing uh, in yeah. VR. And then on Friday, we're going to be playing some more Ratchet and Clank PS4 to round out the month of Ratchet on PS Plus. Nice. Uh, and then North Carolina will be back on Monday. We'll be back on Tuesday and Wednesday next week. We're going to be playing A Way Out. We're going to play some Sea of Thieves. And then Friday next week, we're going to play whatever Corey wants because I'll be out of town. Holy uh, moly. Probably Dig Dug. <laughs> not Dig Dug. I do love Dig Dug, though. It was one of the first video games I ever played. It's a darn good game. Yeah. So thank you all for watching. As always, thank you for your clicks and follows, for sharing with your friends, hosting us, all that good stuff. And uh, we'll see you tomorrow, 11 a.m. from North Carolina. And then you'll see us back here, or at least me, not Adam. He's going to be working, but we'll have some other insomniacs on the couch cool. playing uh, Ratchet and Clank on PS4 on Friday. For all of us here at Insomniac, thank you for watching very much.